Welcome to Systems Alliance, my name is Jexy, and in this video we're going to go ahead and check out Marvel Studios' Avengers Endgame Special Look. So as I mentioned, the first trailer for Avengers Endgame didn't really give us a lot of story. I mean, we kind of know what the story is going to be. They have to somehow reverse what Thanos did. So there really wasn't a lot that they could spoil for us in terms of that, but it's obviously going to be the journey there. How are they going to get there? And then how are they actually going to do it? So as far as how they're going to do it, I'm sure that won't be revealed in any trailers. Marvel has this down. They're not revealing any of that stuff. They've even put in tricks like, you know, the Hulk in Avengers Infinity War when he was never really in it. So I'm really hoping to not get anything spoiled for me with this trailer. But at the same time, it would be nice to see exactly how everyone's feeling, what's going on. That's what I think we really care about because we're so invested in these characters. So Marvel had this coincide with the release of the pre-sale tickets for Avengers Endgame, which obviously very smart to do. Um, Disney just flat out knows what they're doing when it comes to their Marvel properties. So um, really, without further ado, I mean, shoot, we could talk all day and night about what we think is going to happen in Endgame, but for now, let's just go ahead and check out the trailer. If we do this, we'd be going in shorthanded. Yeah, you mean because he killed all our friends? We owe this to Amber. everyone who's not in this room to try. Clean shaven again. It's not about how much we lost. It's about how much we have left. Oh, she made it. Where's the Avengers? We gotta finish this. Stormbreaker. I do. Nice. Oh, they're in there. You okay. Could not live with your Rocket. own failure. Is that Thanos? Where did that bring you? Josh Brolin. Back to me. Oh shoot. Tickets on oh. sale now. So wow, they actually skipped the whole uh, "How's everyone doing? How do we get there?" thing to. They're already there in front of Thanos again, and whew, I did not expect that, and at least we kind of get to see, I guess, what it looks like when they're there, but wow, um, that was crazy. Did not expect to see that, and still, I do like it. Nothing is spoiled. So, obviously, Tony gets rescued somehow. We knew he would be from the first trailer, even though they were making it look so hopeless for him, so it is nice to see that, okay, they found him. Still don't know how they found him. I don't know if it's uh, Rocket somehow. Obviously, they're in uh, the Quinjet. Or, sorry, they're not in the Quinjet. They're in the Milano, um, named, of course, after Alyssa Milano. So, um, yeah, it's just interesting to see where this is all going. I can't wait to see this movie. I mean, it looks like it's going to be amazing. There's so much at stake, and yet... We, we know somehow, right? They gotta. They gotta reverse this somehow. There, there's gotta be a way. I mean, we know because we're getting another Spider-Man movie. We're getting another Black Panther movie. All these other movies. So they're gonna succeed somehow. But how do they do it? And that, we just don't know yet. So uh, let me know your thoughts. How do you think they're gonna reverse the snap, basically? Where do you see this going? How do you think this final showdown is gonna go that... At least, I don't know if this is the final showdown. Maybe not. Maybe this is just a midway through the movie second act showdown between them and Thanos. Where do you see this going down? Do you see any new characters popping in that could possibly help them? They've introduced a bunch of other characters in other movies that they've never used again, but definitely have in their back pocket. So let me know your thoughts down in the comment section below. Be sure to like, subscribe, share, hit me up on Twitter, and we'll catch you next time.